Here's a question for parents. Do you need some extra help with food this summer? Well, for the second year in a row, families can apply for the Pandemic Eligibility Bit Benefits Transfer. It's also known as the PBT. P-E-B-T, I can't say it, but that's what it is. Our Patrick Johnson takes us to Jim Hall County, shows us how families there and across the Coastal Bend can apply for that and get that help that they need. So there's been a struggle for some families to put food on the table. For eligible families, the PEBT program can be a lifesaver. I have four kids at home, and when school lets out or we're on any type of vacation from school, that's like the big thing is, oh my God, I need to feed my kids. But who is eligible? Kids that qualify for free or reduced price meals, families with kids born after August 1st, 2014 who receive SNAP benefits, and kids who attend CEP or Provision 2 schools, which includes Jim Hogg County ISD. There are some children that the two best meals that they get are when they are in school. To be able to have that available and to be able to have the means to go to the grocery store and get what you need, that's a big load off of someone's mind if they've got that. This program is especially helpful during the summer when kids aren't here at school and getting breakfast and lunch. Especially teenagers, the kids eat a lot and and so this, it really, really helps out a lot. When kids are home, the grocery bill doubles or triples and, it, and it's, you know, on top of expenses you already had. Families can receive money for each eligible child. For more information on the program, contact your child's school district or go to our website, chrisdv.com. Reporting for the Rebound Coastal Bend, I'm Patrick Johnstone.